Welcome back girlies. Oh my goodness, you guys, we are back finally for our part three of the Christmas haul. Um, I am also collaborating again with my girl Blanca. She will also be sharing her Christmas haul part three. You guys know this has been like a three part series because we have just been shopping, shopping, shopping and finding all of the cute must have Christmas items this season. So we are finally, I think, ending it here with our part three because, you know, I think we all pretty much at this point, some of us have everything that we need for the season. And even if we don't, we probably should just be done because listen, it's getting into the point where we need to be Christmas shopping for family members, friends, children, spouse, you know, so now decoration spending should be pretty much over. Oh yes, I cannot wait to dive straight into it and show you guys lots and lots of things that I have. Um, I'm going to also kind of pick up where I last left in my last video when I shared with you guys my Winter Wonderland coffee bar slash hot cocoa bar. I have lots of mugs and cups to show and I'm going to also add those to my coffee bar today. So if you guys did not see them, see the last video, please check it out. That one I also collaborated with my girl Sharla. So be sure to check out the last video, which I will post in the description below if you missed that one. As always, after you are done watching my Christmas haul part three, please be sure to check out my girl Blanca's video, which will be added in the description below. So if this is something you're interested in, if you would love to see all the cute girls pink mist and Christmas finds please continue to stay tuned and watch this video all the way through thank you guys all right like, so some of this stuff it. I don't even remember what I brought anymore you guys because I have been storing things for the longest I feel like this haul is maybe accumulation of like three weeks so okay yeah so some stuff I'm not even sure what I have anymore all right, so first up is this super cute snowflake coffee mug. This one is similar to the other one that I found at TJ Maxx, but this one was from Home Goods. And the difference with this one is that it has a silver handle, which I'm really not feeling the handle too much. That's why I super, superly love this one because, well, number one, this one's way bigger and I love that it's just all straight clear. So there's the difference with the two mugs. All right, all right. It's probably not gonna be a no type of orderly fashion here because things are all over the place. Um, I don't know if I share with you guys my snowflake straws, but these are snowflake reusable straws by My Mind's Eye, and these were from Home Goods. So, you guys know if you watched my videos in October when I did the ghost setup and everything, and I found the cute pink straws with the ghost. Those were my favorites. And I wish, this is by the same brand, but I wish she would have made these pink with the snowflakes. Pink with white snowflakes would have just seriously killed this whole season. But they're clear with silver snowflakes. So it'll do though, because you guys know that's going to my coffee bar. And I also realized that I forgot to add these to my coffee bar when I showed you guys the video. So I am just all over the place. Okay, next up is some... Uh, makeup because you guys know I love doing my little makeup display for the season so we have some really cute packaging here these are from TJ Maxx super adorable this is beauty concepts yes beauty concepts and this is just like some chapsticks but I really loved the packaging so it has a lot of snowflake Christmas tree and pink stuff you know really pretty the hot chocolate eyeshadow palette is also from beauty concepts um like I said before, I really don't use this type of makeup just because, I don't know. I don't know if the pigmentation is there for me, but the packaging is, so that's why I brought that. All right, all right, all right. We have some paper cups. These are really pretty. Let me take one out because I don't like the glare, but happy holidays with super cute pink watercolor looking trees i absolutely love these disposable cups those will be also added to my coffee bar and these are new this season i don't think these were out last season but um i also found these at tj maxx all right you guys this super cute mug well tumbler that's kind of surfacing around adorable if you guys know last season they had the pink one with the ghost on it and then this year it's pink with the santas and all the different ethnicities and race and i love it i love the different diversity on this 
tumbler. So this is really pretty. Also, it's huge. Um, okay, you guys, it's missing the straw because listen, this is what I was gonna do. This is what I was gonna do with this. So Y'all know the pink straw that came with the ghost tumbler. I wanted to swap it out and put it in this one because it came with the red straw, which when I tried to pull it out, I broke the straw. So let me show you guys that. What we have here. This is the cup that I was talking about from last season, not last year, but last season for Halloween. This was the really cute cup, same brand, but I love the straw here. Like I feel like they failed me when they put the red. So I tried to remove, I don't know what I was trying to do, but basically I broke the straw, so I can't use it anyway. But what I'm gonna do is swap out. If I don't tear this one apart, I'm trying to be careful because I don't know why. Oh, you know what? Let me just swap the whole cup. Ooh, because I don't really like a lot of red. Oh, you know what? The, the lids are different. This doesn't even fit that, that good. But let's just see what it will look like because, you know, it's perfect for cute pictures. So that's all we care about. Other than, you know, also using this. This is a nice cup to use, to be honest. Like if you're on the go a lot, this is perfect for work, perfect for traveling because it keeps your cups. Yeah, these straws are different. Two total different straws. So I don't think this is going to work. So I tried it, you guys, but look how cute that is. Like, it's so much cuter with the pink. I don't know. Maybe I'll order a pink straw. Maybe I should try to order a pink straw and maybe a pink lid, but I don't know how easy that'll be because this cup is very different and the sizing is way off from last season. So I don't know. But yes, these are the two cups and this is adorable. Moving right along, I found these cute gingerbread cookie looking uh, pajama pants. And I grabbed these, like, I would say September, to be honest, but I don't think I ever took them out to show you guys. But there was, like, one random pair just sitting on the shelf. Not the shelf, but on the rack. And, you guys, I've never seen them again. Nobody else said that they've seen these, but if you did see these, please comment below and let me know. Because I, I thought these were, like, maybe some leftovers from last year because nobody else said they could find them. And it was only one pair. So I grabbed it because it was my size, and I love a knit-looking material super cozy and comfy and then you know i'm loving everything gingerbread so i had to grab these they're not pink but they're gingerbread and that's like a theme this season so i needed those okay these next items oh and those were from marshall's by the way if you can find them these next items are so cute oh my god these little girls little angels are from home goods i've found these i think early like september in home goods i did still see these in the store though so they're still there surfacing but how cute are these adorable little angels? Like, I love the mix match color. She's wearing the nice pretty ivory color with rose gold bow and star. And then she has a beautiful pink with gold. I mean, it is adorable to put by your tree. Not sure where I'm gonna put them, but I am gonna give my daughter one and then I'm gonna keep one. I don't remember which one she picked, but they're both so cute. And they're sisters, they're so pretty. Okay, this other item is also from early this season. And you guys, another super pretty, this is like a ballerina. And like I told you guys before in one of my videos, I used to be a ballerina when I was younger. So I have a special thing for ballerinas. And you guys, this one sings. It's so cute. Oh my God, her star is moving. Y'all, I didn't even notice that. Isn't she just the prettiest? Like she is so gorgeous. And it's crazy because I found her so early in the season and y'all know I'm really not into silver, but I don't think I knew what colors I was gonna do then. So I kind of just grabbed her and was like, I may use her, but I don't really know where I'm gonna put her. So we'll have to see about that. This is, let's see, TJ Maxx. Yes, TJ Maxx, you guys. Look at these so pretty pink snowflake slippers you guys know i love a nice cute cozy pair of slippers and i had to have these oh i had to have these because of the snowflake you guys know i'm so winter wonderlandish with everything and for snowflake and pink to be together it's a must have so yes i absolutely love these and these were only like six dollars from uh what did i say tj maxx yeah six dollars i mean come on we can add those to our collection all right next item is this really gorgeous pink another little mini size tumbler. So I love this one because it's small. I do like a nice smaller tumbler. Like I said, the other one with the Santa is a lot bigger, but this one also keeps your hot drinks hot for six hours, cold drinks cold for 12. So perfect for on the go, work, traveling, all that good stuff. And I mean, this is just absolutely pretty. It's such a pretty pink. 
All right, up next is Burlington. Okay, so of course a lot of people seen these super pretty mugs going around. They are, it's a pretty gold, it says Mary on it and has snowflakes. You guys know I'm everything snowflake, so how cute is that about to be? Super cute. Um, And then of course the other one that goes with that. It's cold outside. Oh my gosh, you guys. These mugs are just so pretty this year. Like, I can't believe how many beautiful mugs there has been. I like almost every store too. It's not just one store, but they're all kind of just spread out throughout the different stores. And it's just, you know, amazing. Okay, so I know this isn't really Christmas related, but I had to grab it because look at that pattern here. Like, I love me a nice pink and white, clearly. And... I know I'm gonna use this tray for something. So I'm probably gonna put this or display it on one of my um, ottomans or just even the table or something just to kind of display something here really pretty and themish. So I don't know if I'm gonna use it for this season, but I know off seasons, I'm gonna be using this a lot in my pink room. So I had to grab it. And this was from Home Goods for $12.99. Another item is this gorgeous, gorgeous candle. This one's from Burlington. We all love this because of the packaging. So, you know, pink and gingerbread is very popular this season. And a lot of us wanted this candle. I like the scent. Some people don't, but it really does smell. It's like a light scented, I would say vanilla and gingerbread. It does give those notes. It doesn't really say the notes on here, but I can smell the drink. Vanilla and gingerbread. Vanilla and gingerbread. I was about to say virginia bread. Whatever. <laughs> but you guys know, tongue tie. Ah! Now, next, we're about to get to a few. I have a few last items. You guys, why am I so tongue-tied? I have a few couple super, super cute, super trendy mugs that I'm getting ready to show you guys. And then that pretty much wraps up our haul for today. I don't have that much, so this was pretty good. It was decent. Like I said, I think this is pretty much it because you guys know early in the season, part one and part two, which I will also link below, that's where I found all my good stuff. So now it's kind of just like the little filler stuff, but nothing crazy. So... Other than some of these mugs that a lot of people are hunting for. If you know, you know. Um, but let's just start with this one. How cute is this Santa, you guys? You know, if you watched my coffee bar video, I had the pink, pink handle and the white handle one. And then they came out with the mint green color one this year. And you guys, it's a must have, seriously. TJ Maxx and he's just adorable. I love it. Like we're all pretty much doing pastel colors. So he fits right in with all the other pink stuff that we have and all the other mugs that are in this um, collection, but have the different colors. Okay. Another mug from TJ Maxx would be this super cute pink Christmas tree. Oh my gosh, you guys. And this comes with a little keychain. I mean, how cute is peppermint and pine? She's really just killing it or well, I'm assuming it's a she or her, but this company is really killing it with the mugs. Like there are so many pretty mugs in this collection or this brand for this season. And um, yeah, I, I love it. I love this. I mean, this is the, the most prettiest pink shade and Christmas trees, pink and white. I mean, it's very subtle. You guys know. So I love that. Um, okay. And of course, you know, we have to leave the best for last. So can you guys just take a guess? what I might have here. Let's just get straight to it. You guys know it's story time because there's always stories when we find amazing things. All right, all right. So I know a couple of you seen this mug in my coffee display video. However, I really didn't want to share with it until I shared part three haul because it was kind of like a late fine and I didn't really want to share it then. But let me tell you guys the backstory. So, you know, this is the crazy infamous mug of the year, which I mean, can you even see why? I mean, look at this. This thing is just absolutely stunning. It's it's literally a must have because it's the perfect shade of brown for the gingerbread part and then pink subtleness. And it's the icing for me. It's the snowflake. It's just the whole mug for me. So again, by Peppermint and Pine. Found this one at TJ Maxx. Of course, coming out on the cart, um, yeah, didn't even make it to the shelf and I just like snatched it up because, so again, I had like this urge and feeling like something was, I think TJ Maxx was like whispering to me, it was like, come in today, come in today, the mug is here. Listen, I know y'all probably think I'm crazy, but listen, 
I don't know if you guys ever got those urges to just like go shop. So I don't know if you guys get those urges to just like go in the store and shop because you have this feeling that an item might be there. And listen, it was one of those days. It was just like, I felt like it was going to be there. I felt like it was calling me. I went in. I was like, all right, it's not in the coffee spot. It's not where they put all the mugs. So like, all right, let me check seasonal because I know sometimes they like to display these things on the end tables where they have all the Christmas decor wasn't there I'm like it's still calling me it's calling me it's calling me I go to the back of the store you guys listen right on the cart if y'all follow me on Instagram y'all seen the video it was right there saying Bria come get me and I said oh I sure will pick it up put it in the cart put it in the cart okay guys I'm done play time's over but anyway yes that's what happened with this one the one that I had in my video last video which was a couple days ago I had to order that off Macari so let's just get straight to this whole Macari talk and how the mugs are going for like $50 and now today they're at like $60 it's getting crazy out there so you guys if you can hunt it try but I'm just y'all know how what I say all the time less is more stop wasting your gas stop wasting your time stop wasting your energy just click the button but however just, just pay for it. If you want it, you want it, buy it. I mean, we spend $50 easily here and there and it is what it is. I mean, it's, it's a must have you guys. All right. Don't take notes from me guys. Like seriously, if you don't have that $50, don't, don't do that. Cause that is not probably being responsible. <laughs> but listen, I hit that button and I ordered it and then look what happens. I find it. So you could be like me and do that. And then you go find it in the store or you could go order it and just invest your $50 into a mug that you're going to have for years to come. And that is beautiful. And it's going to make your soul happy. Choice is yours. But, you know, don't take advice from me because, listen. So we're going to feature this mug today because, listen, you guys, it's perfection. Look at that. Y'all, ah! y'all know I could be a marketer because I will have y'all spending y'all $50 to $60 on these. Let me know if you're going to order off Macari. And let me know if I influenced you, okay? Okay? Because... I, look, I paid 50 straight up. I paid $50 and guess what? I don't regret it and I don't care because it is what it is. Okay, moving right along. Da, 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 da. Okay, Mr. Gingy. Oh my God, you guys know that's my name for gingerbreads. Mr. Gingy, he's finally home. Like Mr. Gingy will just go right on home to his home. I have it. Look at the set. I mean, you guys. Like I said, don't take the advice from me, but <laughs> so this one I did not find in stores either. I am not having any luck with this one, but I'm also really not hunting because I have spent lots of my days hunting early in this, like September and you know, we are not in November now. So I'm pretty much done hunting for the most part. I mean, if I, I still go in the stores and if I see things or if they're calling me, they'll come to me, but I'm not going out here stressing, wasting energy, burning electricity because you guys know I have a Tesla, so I don't really waste money on gas but I still have to pay my husband has to pay the electricity bill so I'm not wasting my electricity all right guys I'm done playing <laughs> so Blanca had was stalking Macari and she brought this back maybe a week or two ago like for the, actually the week they first came out when the prices were very low like these prices were like 13 15 18 dollars for these cuties can you believe it I know it's crazy if you go look today they're like 50 60 dollars so you know, by the more the time, the more you wait, when you think about like, oh, let me just wait. I might run into it in the store. You're literally costing yourself because if you don't find it in the store, guess what? Macari is only going up. Prices are only going to be probably like $60, $70. I mean, I can imagine. Like I'm saying it now. I'm telling you guys, the more and more these mugs get more popular, people are going to raise the price. Who would have thought it would have went to 50 and who would have thought it would have went to 60 now a week later? So hit the button, you guys. I'm telling you because these things are only going to go up in price and if you can't find they're like so hard to find so when I went to the store to actually find this like I said it was on the cart one absolutely one like how did I get lucky to find one mug out of everybody else that's in the store one like you don't even have a choice to have like oh there's three or four make your options better but there's one I mean that is like a needle in a haystack I'm done preaching you guys because y'all I'm just I'd be so serious about this hunting game I don't know about y'all but I'm just like this stuff gets so tiring but anyway back to Blanca finding me this she found a, this lady was selling it a set so she sold two of these and she was able to grab it for $30 so we scored in a sense this one's still probably like the tag's not on it but I think this one's still the same price as this one or a dollar less so maybe $4.99 or $5.99 but 
basically it was $15 because, you know, we paid 30 for two. So that's a decent price. And like I said, now today they're 50. So we didn't score it or if we didn't purchase last week, we would have been out of luck. So I'm just letting you guys know it's still your choice at the end of the day. You still can think it's it's impulsively crazy to buy a mug for $50. But guess what? So did a lot of people do that with the, the Kohl's mug last year or last season. The Kohl's mug, if you guys know what I'm talking about, the ghost mug holding the little pumpkin, little Jack Lantern, it was absolutely adorable. And I swear, like, I would pay $50 if I had to. But I got lucky and I didn't have to, thank God. But that doesn't always happen. So sometimes you're just going to have to pay. That's that's the, that's the game, you guys. It's the game. You got to play. What is it? You got to pay to play. So are you going to pay or are you not going to play? All right, I'm done, you guys. I'm done playing around. Happy Friday. Thank you guys for tuning in with me. Y'all know I'm just a whole joke and a half, but I'm super excited. So I don't have to be out here stressing. They'll call me if they're out here and they want me to find them, but if not, so there's that. And again, if you love this video, please don't forget to like it. I love when you guys do that. It just makes my heart so warm. I'm so happy to have you guys here. I'm happy for you guys to just keep tuning in with me and leaving your sweet, beautiful, kind comments. I absolutely love it. I try to comment as much as I can. You guys know I'm super busy outside of this YouTube life and social media. I have two children and a husband. And then I just also have myself that I have to care for. So you know, I, when I get time, I do like to engage and interact with you guys. But Please be patient with me because I have so much other stuff to do as well. But I see it. I see your comments. I see your messages. And I will try to respond as quickly as possible. So again, if you love this video, please like it. And also subscribe if you're new here so you can stay tuned for more future girly hauls, shopping hauls, seasonal hauls, uh, lots of decorations and decor to come, and more collaboration. So if you're here from Blanca, if she sent you, thank you for joining. Thank you for being here. And also, please do not forget to check out her part three Christmas haul. And as always, see you guys in my next video.